Where is the dark side of the moon? Here's a nice picture of the moon I took some time ago using my dwarf telescope. And as you can see, half of it is pretty dark and a little slither of it is kind of lit up. Another picture I took here, you can see a lot more of the moon is lit up. Comparing these two pictures and focusing on the so-called seas on the moon's surface, now these are not really seas, this is just what people in the 17th century thought could be bodies of water, you can see that in both pictures the so-called sea of crisis is in daylight, it's lit up. However, in one picture the sea of tranquility is in the light, but in the other the sea of tranquility is completely dark. So that kind of begs the question, which side of the moon is the dark side of the moon? To answer this, we've got to think a little bit about what causes the moon to change in appearance. As we know, the Earth, of course, orbits around the sun and the moon orbits around the Earth. Additionally, the moon doesn't actually produce any of its own light. It reflects the light that comes from the sun, which is why we can see it in the sky, but it doesn't glow in the same way that the sun or a light bulb or a hot coal on a fire produces its own light. Let's start by looking at the configuration of the Sun, Earth and Moon when we have a new moon. Now, a new moon is where you can't really even see the moon in the sky. However, this isn't because the moon isn't being lit up, it's just that the side of the moon we're looking at doesn't have any light hitting it from the Sun. If you look here at the perspective of someone on the Earth looking up at a new moon, you'll see that half of the moon is still being lit up, it's just that the half we are looking at happens to be dark. So is that the dark side of the moon? Is it facing us during a new moon? Well, sort of, but it actually makes a lot more sense to think of it from the perspective of someone living on the moon. If you're one of these moon people living on the surface of the moon, then actually you experience half the time as night and half the time as day, just like somebody living on the Earth. When it's a new moon, the people that are on the left side of the, the moon, as I've drawn it, are experiencing lunar day, and the people on the right side of the moon are experiencing lunar night. But half of a lunar day later, it'll be reversed, and the people over here will be in daylight, and the moon people over here will be in nighttime. So the conclusion here is actually that there is no perpetually dark side of the moon and a perpetually light side of the moon. It changes just the way the night and day changes on the Earth. These two moon people in red and in green over here will both experience night and both experience day. Now, although there's no dark side of the moon, there is, however, a back side of the moon. This is because the moon is what we call tidally locked as it orbits the Earth. So the same side of the moon is always facing us as it orbits. As it goes around the Earth, the rate at which it rotates on its own axis is the same as the rate at which it orbits the Earth. Therefore, this red guy I've drawn on the left side of the moon will never see the Earth in the sky because he is living on the back side of the moon, the bit that never looks towards the Earth. However, the green person will almost always be able to see the Earth in the sky, apart from one time in the lunar cycle. Can you tell me when that will be? 